Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can use the extract command in the menu bar to isolate a foreground object from an image and then erase its background. This works especially well on objects that have very fine or wispy edges that your other selection tools have difficulty selecting. The extract command was actually removed from the general installation starting in Photoshop CS4. It is still available as an optional plugin at adobe.com along with instructions on how to install it. To use the extraction command, open the image from which you wish to extract an element and then select filter and extract from the menu bar. That will launch the extract dialog box that we see here where you can see the image. The first thing to do is to click the edge highlighter tool in the upper left hand corner of this dialog box. Then click and drag around the border of the element that you want to extract, highlighting all of the edges completely and enclosing the image element that you wish to retain within the highlighted border. So we'll click and begin to drag all the way around. After you've completed that, then click the Fill Tool button, located just below that, and click inside of the image element that you wish to retain. It should fill in the area with the highlighted border there, indicating that this is what you wish to keep. Now if you want to preview how the extraction would look, click the Preview button in the upper right hand corner of the dialog box. You can then click the Cleanup Tool button at the left side of the dialog box. We've got some different buttons over here on the left hand side. We've got the Eraser Tool, the Cleanup Tool, the Edge Cleanup Tool, and so forth. So we're going to click the Cleanup Tool. And then you can drag with this tool over the edges of the image that you wish to discard. This tool will change the pixels it selects to a transparent color. So if you click and drag, you'll see what that does is it actually changes it to transparent. So you would use that to clean up these straight edges here that you want to erase to transparency and so forth. The Eraser tool allows you to erase the highlight that you created in the selection, but you could also click the Edge Touch-Up Tool button. You'll see that right here. You then click and drag with this tool over the edges of the extracted element to clean up and redefine the edges of the newly extracted object for touch-up purposes. So we go over the sides here that will just touch up all the way around. Like that. Now, if you need to move the image or zoom the image, note that the hand and zoom buttons are available, located right here at the left. Now feel free to then zoom in on the edges for cleanup purposes. You can really get in there really close and do some fine touch up. And then when you're finished extracting the element, you just click OK to return to the newly extracted element in the image. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.